Hi, and welcome to Photo Tripping America. Join Sully and I today as we visit the ghost town of Winfield, Colorado. <music> The town of Winfield, Colorado sits at 10,243 feet above sea level, about the same altitude as its famous northern neighbor of Leadville. But unlike Leadville, Winfield didn't continue to grow. Today, it's just a ghost town. Its streets are full of whispering breezes that tell of the history of this small mining community. There are a few cabins left to look into and a couple of historical structures. This is the Ball Cabin, built in 1870. It has a couple of displays inside that you can view through the door, or when the building is open, you can go in. And here's the schoolhouse left over from those mining days, complete with its own lacy curtains in the front windows. It's really hard to envision three saloons, two hotels, and even a church also being in this town. And this little schoolhouse servicing the children of up to 1,500 people when Winfield's population was at its greatest. The mountains that surround Winfield are made up of several 14,000 foot mountain peaks, bringing with them great beauty, adventure, and sometimes danger. In 1994, a Flight for Life helicopter crashed here on Mount Huron. Here we see a marker that the Buena Vista Sheriff's Patrol put up as a memorial to the pilot and flight nurse who lost their lives in that crash. There are several other structures in and around Winfield to take a look at, but it's the natural beauty here that is really overwhelming. If you like to camp, there are plenty of places to do that all along County Road 390 from Highway 24 all the way in 12 miles to Winfield. The road itself is very graded for the first four miles, and the last eight miles is a little ruddy, but two-wheel drive vehicles can make it easily as long as there's no snow on the road. Fishing is also a great pastime here in Clear Creek or on Clear Creek Reservoir, or just enjoy hiking on the Continental Divide Trail. On the way back out to the highway, we discovered Crescent Mining Camp. It's actually on the site of an old mining town called Rockdale. And these cabins have been refurbished by the National Forest Service. You can actually rent them for $50 a night during their season, stretching from May 15th through October 31st. Oh goodness, look who I found here. I guess he's decided he's found a place he wants to stay. Sully, sorry, we're gonna have to leave. We've got more places to explore. But thank you for joining us today in Winfield, Colorado. Music